Welcome back to SnowRunner. It's been a little while since our last SnowRunner video, but today we are jumping back in. This isn't any mods. This isn't any funny business. There is a brand new Yukon expansion for SnowRunner, and we're gonna jump into it for the very first time. There are also three brand new vehicles. There is some new SnowRunner customization, as well as some very, very cool missions that we are gonna attempt to do. In severe local conditions, you will have new mechanics in your disposal that will help you overcome every obstacle in your way, okay? Welcome to the Yukon up in the Canadian wilderness. Anyways, we've got our Chevy Duramax. I think if we're gonna start things up properly, we should probably start this off with going to get a couple of the watchtowers just so we kind of know where to go. Oh, geez. Okay, maybe this is gonna be a little bit more difficult than I thought. Maybe we'll start with this watchtower. Oh, Matt. Are you for real? I just want to go and discover a watchtower, buddy. And you're chucking all of this stuff in my way, so... They want us to build this bridge. We need two metal beams. So I need a truck with a trailer to pick up the metal beams. Okay, 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 okay. Crane, if you could go from there to the metal beams, that would be much appreciated. Now lift it up. Oh, no, 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 no. What are we doing? Oh my God. No! For God's sake. So this time we will use those things so we won't flip upside down this time nick i thought you said you weren't gonna mess this up great foreshadowing nailed it all right lovely look at that that only took us 18 minutes to do <laughs> and we will be one out of two apparently the game's telling me over there i can get a couple more metal beams so that might be something nailed it one of two completed all right give me one second see the canadian wilderness is oh my god reverse maybe it will stop me maybe it will stop me <laughs> maybe if white water usually means it's shallower right am i right in thinking that maybe let's go buddy oh yes look at that that is a 200 iq play ladies and gentlemen across the water into a mud bog where am i going by the way Oh, I'm going all the way over there to the warehouse. I forgot how insane the mud was on this game. And, um, proving to be rather sticky. No! Why does this always happen to me? Every time. Every bloody time this happens to me. They see Nick rolling. They hate him waiting for Nick to recover his vehicles. No, 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 no. Can we just get an F in chat for the pink truck that will forever be flipped upside down right over there? All right. We don't have very far to go. It's just around this corner. We have arrived. We can pick up our metal beams. Yo, look at this. There's only two metal beams remaining at this area over here. Jeez, so you cannot mess these missions up anymore. You've only got a limited amount of stuff. The power of Mother Russia. You'll love to see it, let's go. We're gonna go straight up to the other side of this bridge. Then we can open it up for our Chevy Silverado and go exploring the rest of Canada. Let's go. As of amazing job getting us here in one piece we didn't flip the russian truck even once we get some money get some xp from that and now we can continue to go and explore the rest of canada okay i think this is the perfect vehicle to go and explore canada in yes sir now that we've got this bridge open we can come through here and I'm gonna try to get this watchtower. I'm just gonna say, I think that's probably a little bit harder than I think it will be. Look at the water though, flowing right the way down. I'm just gonna say if we do run into 
a waterfall, that won't be a good thing. Gotta do a little bit of rock crawling in the raptor. Can we grip, please? Speed and power. Yes! Shit. What? How? No. I think I can just go this way. Way easier than going all the way over that. What am I doing? Why didn't I do this before? That is so much better. Okay, that's not... Oh. Um... I nailed it! And the raptor is back on the move. Let's, uh, why, why do you put such a big hole in my way? I had a feeling that we would be ending up in a lot of deep snow. So I wanted chain tires instead of mud tires or anything like that. Okay, I am really, really, really in the Canadian wilderness now. Okay, yo, there's a little place over here and I've got to go up the side of a mountain. I'm going to stick to this path, actually. And come into here. Maybe there's a road I could use. I, it looks like a logging camp. There's a lot of logs over there. And unfortunately for me, there's no easy way up this mountain. Can we make our way up here? This is going to be a lot of winching. But look at the raptor. We're not even winching that. And it's just crawling on up. That's sick. Every single one of you in Twitch chat doubted me. No, 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 no. The Canadian knows what's going on in the Canadian wilderness. Thank you very much. Less than 200 meters away now. Yo, there's the watchtower. Okay, we've actually nearly made it up the side of this mountain. I think there's actually a road right in front of us over this little ledge up onto the rocks. Okay, I've just got to get up there now. Oh, geez, this is steep. That's steep. Oh, my God. How is the raptor doing this? This is defying all physics right now. The raptor is like a mountain goat as it navigates all of the rocks. We have made it to the watchtower. Let's go. Oh, man. Take a look at Canada. We are really in the middle of nowhere. Is that one of the new trucks in SnowRunner? There's an abandoned truck right here. It doesn't tell me what it is. There's also an abandoned trailer. This is going to be my plan. I think it's going to be really, really fun to come down here. That's my idea of a ski hill. So we'll come all the way down there. We'll probably end up recovering the vehicle. We'll come back through this path. And then we'll come over here to the abandoned trailer and the abandoned truck. Okay. If I can get down the mountain in a minute and a half, I get a bunch of money. Okay. I'm going to accept this and go, 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 go. I've got to get to that point over there with the magnifying glass. That is exactly the way that I want to go. Chuck the thing up into high range. This is sheer ice right now. I would not be able to stop or get up that in any regard. So we actually got up, up the mountain the correct way. Okay, we're doing okay. Come on, Raptor. Come on, speed machine. That's a lot of rocks in my way. Come on! Where are you going? Come on, raptor! Oh, I forgot to winch. Winch! Pull me! Go! 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 I'm racing! I'm nearly there. I'm nearly there. Turn! Go! Oh my god, there's so much stuff in the way. Straight over. YOLO, send it, sunshine. Oh my god, I am so good at this game. Oh my god, I am... I am the most Canadian person in the entire world. I'm gonna do it! Let's go! Let's go! Full marks! One minute and 20 seconds! Let's go! All of that and we didn't even roll the thing, so we're all re- Aw, oh, damn it! We have to go all the way back up! All the way over there! Alright, so just like that, we arrive at the house. There's a job here, and there it- Wait. That is the abandoned truck. Wait, wait, wait. Please tell me I don't need to repair this thing and drag it somewhere, stupid. Hello, wanderer. I've recently moved from the frosty top of the hill closer to the water. And I had nothing to tow my old broken truck here. Will you help? We're going to ignore both of those missions because the people in this game are just stupid. So here we go. Dump for dump truck. Okay. Let's accept the job. This is our new vehicle, the Caterpillar 770G. 
That probably means something to somebody. So I'm in the garage here, just gotta come out of the garage, use the bridge that we built, come over here, pick up the trailer, and then literally just come back the exact same way and drop it off at the garage. We are good to go. Reverse on up. Oh, wow, it attached for me. But no, 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 it didn't, it didn't, it didn't, it didn't, it didn't, it didn't, it didn't. I just apparently knocked it. Yeah, I, I think it goes without saying that this trailer is really, really heavy. Watch out, Azov. The Azov is seriously a lifesaver in this game. Stage completed. Okay, so now it wants us to do part two of the mission, which is to fuel up the caterpillar. Okay, then do the same with the Azov. Thank you as well. Now the Azov is out of fuel. Here's what I can do. Recover the Azov, leave the garage. Now I just turn around and I it's right there. Fuel part two, thank you very much. Fill the man all the way up. Task completed, 5,800 bucks. Oh man, there we go. So now if I press the back button, we've got our new caterpillar here in it. Yo, this is... A wide, wide boy. I'm just gonna... Sorry, 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 sorry. I want to try something real quick. If I open up customization, decorations, this is what I was talking about. We've got all these bobbleheads. We've got accessories. We've got air fresheners and stuff. How sick. And then we've got stickers. We barely did anything in this map. It is enormous how much space there is. 